Hey guys, this is Dylan Tutton here with Open Roads. Hope you guys are having a great day. Uh, we are going to go over the Georgetown Forest River today. So this is the Georgetown Forest River 364 TS. So it's going to actually be the bunk model of the Georgetown and the double bath. So it's nice to have a double bath in a motorhome. And I'll go over a couple of those things as well. But just wanted to show you guys this awesome Forest River. So if you guys want, follow me. So again, this is the Forest River. This is on a V10 Ford motor. So what that means is that it's the V10 Ford gas motor. So it's about what every gas motor home you see is going to be on, about the same type of horsepower and gas mileage. And then it, you're going to have the 19 and a half inch wheels. So kind of give you about that usual motor home ride. Go ahead and follow me. TV outside, also going to have double speakers. Very nice for outside entertainment, watching the game, just watching the movie, kicking back at the campground and just hanging out with a bunch of friends. Also, you're going to have your first cross-stitch storage right down here. So it gives you plenty of space, great for picnic tables, great for food, anything you need. One thing I do love, as you'll notice, there's no carpet. No carpet in these because it's super easy to wash out. Anything ever falls out, anything ever stains in here, all you got to do is get a water hose spray. There's a drain hole right there, and it'll be super easy to clean. Now, over here on the other one, this is a, just your standard your standard storage space right here, but also you're going to notice there's a plug right here. So if you wanted to plug in another TV, maybe another speaker or something like that, you definitely can. So it just kind of gives you that versatility that you need whenever you're outside camping. So let's go ahead and go to the back, take a look at your other cross-through motor hole or cross-through storage back here. So you got your cross-through storage right here, a little bit bigger, kind of give you, like I said, more space. It's going to give you just anything that you need as far as for camping needs. This is for a big family, so you got to have big storage. Now, of course, as you get to the back, you're going to have your trailer hitch and your plug-in straight from the factory. So if you guys need to tow a car, need to tow a golf cart or anything like that, you definitely can. And if you look up, you also have your backup camera right there to get into some of those harder, tighter spots. And then of course your ladder. So ladder is mainly just for getting up there on top of the roof. If you need to check the roof, spot, seal it, or even just check the slide toppers, it makes it super easy to get up there. Now, this is the works, how oh, I like to call the work side of the coach. First thing that you might notice is it's super easy to get to the black tank flush. I love that they do this. I love that they kind of make everything just super easy to get to because for those of you that have been camping before, you know it's no fun whenever you really need to get somewhere and it's really hard to get there. So again, super easy to get your black tank flush. It's even really easy to get your 50 amp power cord right here. Really long power cord, so if the, it is a spacious space, you can still plug it up. One other place I want to show you all real quick is where your sitting water, and then of course your outside shower and your tank fill and, your, and all that good stuff is at. You'll notice, again, this is out from up underneath the slide, and it's still easy to get to, but also notice where your sewer hose would go. It's super easy to just kind of to screw that on. It's no fun trying to figure out how to screw that sewer hose on just right. So super easy to get to. Everything, they just kind of make it super easy for the camper. They've, they've tried to go a little bit above and beyond. So if you guys want, follow me. We'll head inside and I'll show you guys everything awesome inside. All right, guys, we are now inside the Georgetown 364. First thing I always love to point out is the bow floor. So what that means is it's just a different type of floor that they use here for Forest River. And it's just really better as far as resistant to different types of heats and stuff like that. It's kind of flex with it and it's not gonna, it's not gonna get, it's not gonna give in to what some of the other materials might do. The other thing you might notice is I already have the bunk drop down as well. I always like to show this. It's a twin size bunk. Again, this is a bunk model. It's always nice to have that third bunk just in case you have friends come along and always need somewhere to sleep. <clears throat> Solid surface countertops, stainless steel sink. So anywhere, any kind of sink that you'll see in here is stainless steel, and it gives you plenty of space in this sink. <clears throat> so also you're going to have your cooktop, your, your oven, and your microwave. So we're going to give you plenty of place to cook, but also they, they give you plenty of places to cook, but they don't neglect the counter space that you need. So kind of give you plenty of, best of both worlds. Now, of course you got your TV right here, but one other thing, you got storage behind the TV. So again, they give you plenty of storage. This is a big family coach. This meant for big storage. <clears throat> now moving on to the sofa. I love recliners. I don't know about you, but they're super comfortable. 
So it's always nice to have a recliner in your motorhome. Both of these are recliners and it's just nice to hang out, kind of chill out while you're at the campground. Now if you look at the dinette, they do have cup holders in the table. I love this because it just kind of makes it easy whenever you're going down the road to just be able to put your, your drink right there and if somebody slams on the brake, you're not, your drink's not going everywhere. Next is going to be your residential fridge. You guys might recognize this. This is something that you probably have at home. Going to give you plenty of space. If you guys need to load up the fridge for a week, you got plenty of it. So you got plenty of plenty of drawer space, plenty of counter space, and then of course you have your ice maker, which is super nice. It's it's a big deal to have an ice maker. It's super nice to have one. And of course you're going to have an awesome sized freezer. So give you plenty of room on your freezer, plenty of room in your refrigerator, and you guys are good to go. Now moving on back to the box. One, these are actually very comfortable mattresses. So it's super easy to get up to, and honestly, you guys probably won't have to get a new mattress once you get into these bunks. Also, they put a TV on both top and bottom of the bunks. So nobody's fighting over who's watching what, where somebody's sitting at, or what have you. It, you can actually have your own TV once you get in the bunks. Now, if you wanna go ahead and come on over on this side, I will show you guys the second of the first bathroom. So again, you have a shower right here, you're gonna have a medicine cabinet behind me. And then of course your, your other stainless steel sink right there with your toilet. So they put the skylight in the shower, it gives you plenty of space, plenty of room, and it's great for whenever you have customer or great for whenever you have people over. Just that way everybody can kind of hang out, but not everybody's using your personal bathroom. So like I said before, this is a triple slide. You got your first slide on the entertainment area. Guys, this, they give you plenty and plenty of space as far as storage. I can't stress that enough. Look at all this storage that they've given you. They give you plenty of hanging, hanging clothes space, but also plenty of drawers. Then, of course, you have your TV in here. And then, of course, on the other side, you have your queen-size bed. So they put windows all the way around. Just kind of give you that little bit more spacious feel. Don't feel claustrophobic. And just kind of makes it feel more open. Now to go into your master bathroom. A little bit more storage in here. If you look to your right, you're gonna have that big hanging area right there. Great for great for towels, great for clothes, whatever you need. This is kind of that extra added on if you need it. And then if you look to your left, you're gonna have your awesome sized shower here as well. So they don't neglect either bathroom as far as showers go. They want to make sure everybody's happy, nobody's fighting over one bathroom or the other, and everybody can kind of get it, get in and out of there at a, at a timely manner. So again, guys, I hope you guys are having a great day. If you guys have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. I'll be more than happy to get back to you. And again, this is Open Roads Complete RV with the Georgetown, where we make American dreams come true.